Child safety seat installation is not always an easy task, but it can be life or death to get it right. So tomorrow afternoon, Homestead County Public Health wants to keep your kids properly buckled by hosting car seat installations at Grand Park. KIMD News 3's Sorel Cray is explaining how parents can make sure they meet Minnesota's new law. To prepare for tomorrow's car seat clinic, the National Highway Safety Traffic Association taught the technicians how to install all different type of children car seats. We're facing boosters, boosters with backs, combination seats, convertibles, that kind of thing. Romanowski says you would be surprised by how many drivers have incorrectly installed child safety seats. Well, statistics tell us that if car seats are installed properly, we have a better chance of having children survive a crash. So far, the five car seats are not installed properly at this time. Statistics tell us that. The child passenger safety law was implemented this past month in Minnesota. Now parents must wait until their child is two to be in a forward-facing car seat. Parents like to go forward-facing before they should. They should remain uh, rear-facing now that we have the new law to two. And um, then coming back to us when they do go forward-facing because we don't usually see caregivers when they go forward-facing. It's one of the things we would like to have more time with. Another aspect of the child safety laws is once a child has reached four years old and they've outgrown the forward facing seat they can ride in a booster seat. Reporting from Rochester, I'm Cheryl Correy, KMT News 3. Car seat check and installation appointments begin tomorrow afternoon at 2 30. It's taking place once again at Grand Park in Crawford Hall. If you'd like to make an appointment, you can go to our website, KIMT.com.